When asked who is the father of electricity, for most people, names like Edison or Tesla come to mind. Welcome to electricity. Who's your daddy? I'm the father of electricity. Oh, no, you're not. I am the father of electricity. However, the real father of electricity is without a doubt Michael Faraday. Step aside, lads, and let the real Mac Daddy show you how it's done. Whose many observations and experiments laid the foundation for numerous inventions that are still in use to this day. One such observation was Faraday's Law of Electromagnetic Induction, now commonly known as Faraday's Law, which he presented to the Royal Society back in 1833. Brilliant. In it, Faraday observed that when the magnetic flux or the magnetic field changes with time, the electromotive force is produced. But what does that have to do with flow meters? Well, a lot, if you're talking about electromagnetic flow meters. Modern electromagnetic flow meters, also known as magnetic flow meters or magmeters, use Faraday's law to determine the flow velocity of a conductive fluid in a pipe.